I'm going to Nigeria. <laughs> it's been long you guys saw me how you're doing so i am moving back to nigeria <laughs> oh i have not been looking forward to this day i have to be honest i have not been looking forward to it and this face is not me being happy i'm just trying to be brave to be honest but anyways i just wanted to give you guys an update that i am moving back to nigeria so this is like a week before I get back to Nigeria. How do I feel? To be honest, I feel very indifferent. I'm having sort of like little little bits of Nigeria anxiety. If you live in Nigeria, you know what I mean. And if you've lived outside of Nigeria and had to move back to Nigeria because of circumstances beyond your control, then you know what I mean. I'm having little bits of anxiety at the moment. Um... Anyway, I do hope that it's going to be better. It's going to be fine. <laughs> I'm keeping a very brave and strong face, but I'm not entirely happy about it, to be honest. But I have to do what's necessary, and I have to do the right thing. So the right thing is, right now, it's for me to pack my bags and go back to Nigeria. But I've showed you the things that I'm packing, but like I said, it's not an exciting time. It's exciting because I get to see my family, but it's not exciting because I get to, I have to move back because of some things beyond my control but anyways um yeah so i'm moving back to nigeria that's the gist and um i just have like three days to pack my stuff and i'm trying to section my things into different categories and then um, um ah, i'm keeping a brave face so um yeah moving back to nigeria updates <clears throat> That's 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 the tweet. Hi guys, it's Rachel again. This is three days before I leave the UK. Yes, I'm going to Nigeria. <laughs> anyway, guys, so I just got back from shopping my literal like last minute shopping before i leave the country and today is actually friday my flight is on monday and then i'm gonna be arriving in nigeria on a tuesday why am i not taking a direct flight well i'm not taking a direct flight because direct flights are pretty pretty very expensive and i feel like the airlines this time around they're on a mission to make back all the money they lost in 2020 due to the pandemic so that's why i'm taking like a connecting flight to Lagos and anyways Qatar Airways is the line this is nice one such but anyway Qatar Airways is the line that I used when I was living in Nigeria and it's actually a very great airline the only thing is you have to stop over in Doha but anyways I just got back from my last minute shopping like I mentioned and I literally like got two bags of things okay the reason why it's two bags is because there are some personal things that I wanted to use to ease my transits to Nigeria and also some things for my clients. Like I mentioned before on this channel, I have a personal shopping service business that I run and I also intend to continue um, running it whilst I'm in Nigeria. So just because I'm coming to Nigeria does not mean that we're not going to make money. We are going to make money. It's just going to be in a different way. So hit me up on ig at pics by ray and then you can you know start a chat with me and let me know what you'd like and also i can offer i also offer on the side personal styling services so if you want me to style you for anything let me know styling is literally consultancy <laughs> but anyways um i wanted to show you guys what how my room looks like but it's a mess it's a mess because i'm packing so I might probably just show you the number of boxes that I have. Final, 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 final. But I am going to go ahead right now and then sort some final things out. Just to know which, what and what things are going into where and sort out my hand baggage and all those kind of things. I've packed the important ones. So I just have like bits and bots all over the place and make my room like look neat and tidy before I land in Nigeria. But anyways, guys, 
this is it this is it this is it like it's really happening what's the procedure it's really happening <laughs> oh my god i can't believe that this is actually happening like this is like a full circle moment for me full circle i mean like you know full circle in terms of the fact that i'm coming back to nigeria and i know that all things are working together for my good like it's not the happiest thing that i would have wanted it's not the i mean i'm, I'm i miss my family and I, i'm looking forward to seeing them i think that that is the only thing i'm really looking forward to the fact that i'm going to see my family again after like about a year and a couple of months but after that you know initial you know outflow of excitement and joy upon seeing them is is somehow 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 going to be back to default settings but i do hope that it doesn't turn out that way but i'm gonna let you guys know how it turns out eventually is it back to default settings or are we you know scaling through and i i, I also discovered that a lot of people keep asking me what are you gonna do when you come back what do you want to do guys i have no idea what it is that i want to do like i know what i want to do but again i don't intend i don't have the intention of putting a lot of pressure on myself to um produce when i say produce no i only use that word um to you know do something i'm already doing something the way i am like this i'm doing a lot of things and i just want to see the results right now i'm just waiting for results so i'm um, at this point is results and so when the results show I'll have lots of stories to tell about, okay, all the things that I've been doing and the results that, you know, came out from them. But anyways, let me go get something sorted and I'll catch you guys hopefully in a bit. Yes. Hi. Hey guys. So this is later on in the evening. I, thank you. I'm going to the cinema with my friends and i um, going to have a nice night. This is like almost seven o'clock in the evening and I'm heading out. As far I live in the UK still now, so I literally have to like go out. <laughs> I am literally late. I'm so late. Yes. I can't show you what I'm wearing. Oh. Makeup even still in my shirt. So at this point, you don't want to do it like that. But that's that's about that. I'll see you guys when I get there. Oh, I forgot to snap the. Hey guys, this is the day before I travel out of London. Um, I have packed all my things. <sighs> this is hard. This is very very hard out there. But I'm about to watch Disney's new um, cartoon called Luca. It is pretty pretty emotional, pretty nice. So let me watch it. Maybe I even need to shed some tears. And I'm about to have jello fries. My last jello fries in the abroad. And some um, finger food. Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to console myself. And I have this Fanta that my colleague gave to me at work. At my, um, yeah, at work. So, yes, I'm about to settle down and just enjoy my alone time. Later this evening, I and my aunt were going to go watch fast and furious nine i think yes and um yeah i'm bringing my head back to nigeria Oh, come on, Jack. Good morning. Today is Monday, the day of my flight to Nigeria. I'm just trying to do some last minute packing. This is it, guys. This is it. So, these are the boxes I'm carrying this one with me, this one, that tiny one, and this bag. These two are supposed to go with me on hand luggage. I mean, I pray that. You know, they don't tell me to drop anything back because I have tried. I've really tried to remove a lot of things. And this one, this one is still 21. And I'm allowed 23. But the problem is the box is not closing. 
This one too, same thing. It's about 19, even though I'm allowed 23. So I still have like extra, but I don't know. I don't know what to do. Another idea is to literally like, I don't know, maybe carry these three and put it in check-in. So I only have that one on my hand. This is so weird, but I don't know. Because that one is already six points. My laptop is really like the major load. So that is already like six point something, 6.6 .6 kg. And I'm allowed 7 kg. This one is <laughs> already, it was 9.9 .9 before I removed something. It's 9.6. God, God help me. see me in London for now till I come again till I come your way <laughs> this is what I'm wearing sorry something stained my trousers, so I have to wash it off this is what I'm wearing if I get an idea I have to remove this jacket because it's a bit cold over here there you go let's go things are coming down which was actually straight before but it has come down to a lot for takeoff we are taxiing right now
<laughs> Look at this dramatic stuff. Yeah, it's not working. Where's not the point? No point. Yo, yo, yo. I'm back to the motherland. Like yes, we used to say. Back to the motherland. My mom is mother motherland of motherland. All of them joy. Family, my brother, daddy. <laughs> Look at me. I'm back in the country. 